Welcome to our home. I'm James. And I'm Jen. And we're excited you're here to watch our adoption video. James and I met in 2005 at a church group for young adults. I had just moved to the area from the Upper Peninsula, and James was in his final year of college. We got to know each other well that first year through Bible studies and doing service projects together. In February 2006, James took me on our first date to a basketball game. For our second date, we went for sushi and to the botanical gardens. James eventually proposed at the same botanical gardens, and we were married in 2009. We went to Mexico for our honeymoon, and we had a great time. A year after we married, we moved to Phoenix, Arizona, where we lived for three years. We loved the warmth of the desert. We moved back to Michigan in 2013 to be closer to family and bought our first home. We adopted our dog, Luna, and we adore her. She is nine years old and very gentle and playful. We are choosing to start a family through adoption, and we could not be more excited to be on this journey. I remember the first day that I met James, and I liked that he didn't always need to be the center of attention, but when he spoke, he was very kind and intelligent, and I desired to get to know him better. James is absolutely the smartest person I know. He is very serious about his Christian faith and providing for our family as an attorney, but he also has a pretty silly side. Sometimes I'll catch him dancing around the house, or he'll make a funny face and make me laugh. He is close with his family and enjoys visiting them as much as possible. James loves sports, especially Michigan State football and basketball. He also grew up playing soccer and will make a great coach someday. I know James will be a great dad because he is so patient and loving and desires to share his love of Jesus, sports, and education with the child. When I first met Jen, I was drawn to her outgoing personality. She can talk to anyone and makes friends easily. Those who know Jen would say she is very talented and hardworking. She enjoys her career in logistics, as well as serving in various ministries at our church, including the youth group and nursery. Jen has a lot of energy. She is close to her four siblings, and I know she's going to be a great mom when I see her interacting with her nine nieces and nephews. She has cared for them as babies, plays with them as kids, and guides them as teens and young adults. She has a huge heart and loves lavishing love and attention on them. I know she is ready to be a great mom. We are both very sentimental and enjoy our family traditions. James's parents live just two miles down the street from us, so we see them often. On Sundays, we attend church and have lunch together. The majority of Jen's family lives in the Upper Peninsula, so we make several trips there every year. We have also enjoyed many summer gatherings with Jen's family at Uncle Bob's Cottage. We celebrate all major holidays and particularly enjoy Thanksgiving and Christmas when we gather with our extended families. We have lived in our house for about five years and we absolutely love it. It is close to our family and friends and near many shopping centers, but at the end of a cul-de-sac in a very quiet neighborhood. We're also within walking distance to a beautiful park. Our favorite part of the house is the open concept kitchen and living room where we can cook and entertain at the same time. We also enjoy our fireplace, especially during the cold winter nights. We have always desired to grow our family through adoption and we are ready to open our hearts and our home to a child. We look forward to providing a child with everything we have to offer, like love, laughter, and education, and extended family, and much, much more. And we are open to any level of openness desired in the adoption relationship. Thank you for taking the time to view our adoption profile and considering us as prospective parents. <laughs>